is 2017. You're rushed to a hospital, unconscious with no ID or medical history, but thanks to a microchip under your skin, it's all there. Science fiction 20 years ago, but a biometric reality today. 2,000 years ago, John the Apostle received a revelation from God, predicting the arrival of the false prophet and the man of sin. The United Kingdom's Information Commissioner claims that in 2017, consumers will be cashless shoppers. A microchip holding personal bank account and credit card information will be implanted into the body, connecting to a database that will know who they are, where they live, what they like, and what they don't like. Shoppers will have their hand scanned, not their credit card. And I stood upon the sand of the sea, and I saw a beast rise up out of the sea, having seven heads and ten horns. The most powerful nation on earth is set to betray its citizens. With new, mandatory revisions to citizenship and constitutional privacy. A system touted as a national security necessity is being used to build a database where the biometric identity of millions of Americans will be gathered and stored. We're meeting with the president in order to formulate legislation that would require every person in the United States of America who is employed to carry a biometric identification card with them. And he calls it all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. And that no man might buy or sell save he that had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. The president put in a lot of money in the stimulus package to advance medical records so that if you have the chip you can carry the records with you they can stick it in a computer they can know all your situations they'll have a gps chip in there so that they can measure everybody every instant no matter where they go your id card would have either your fingerprint your thumbprint on there or it would have a, a reading of the veins in the back of your hand No matter who you meet, if you say 666, all of a sudden, they know what you're talking about. That means you're not going to be able to fly an airplane, you're not going to be able to enter a federal building, you won't be able to drive a car, you won't be able to open a bank account and you were not going to be able to hold a job. Now this is where the rubber meets the road. The U.S. Food and Drug Administration approved the injection of this chip under the skin. The technology is in place. It is happening right now. It's very important that all of us understand the mark of the beast is not a possibility. It is an absolute certainty. You and I are going to face it. Make sure your name is in the Lamb's Book of Life.